In Creo Parametric 9.0, mirroring within Freestyle has been improved, allowing you to mirror complete shapes by a selected datum plane. This enhancement expands the existing mirror functionality available in Freestyle. In prior releases, you are able to mirror mesh faces across a datum plane. In this example, you can select a mesh boundary and select the mirror to create a closed shape by mirroring it across the datum plane. The mirrored side will be dependent on the original mesh faces mirrored. Any change you make to the original side will be reflected on the mirrored object. Now in Creo Parametric 9.0, you can easily select a shape within the freestyle tree and select the mirrored function and desired datum plane. The mirrored shape will be immediately shown on the screen. The mirrored shape will be dependent on the original shape. As you make a change to the original shape, the mirrored side will be updated automatically. As in the past, you can easily enable or disable the mirrored dependency. Selecting the dependent icon, you'll be able to make changes to either shape without it being reflected on the mirrored object. Resuming dependency, changes can only be made to the original shape. If you want to break dependency, you can easily select the break dependency to change the mirrored shape into its own independent shape as reflected in the freestyle tree. Undoing this change, we can resume the dependency. Lastly, you can connect the shapes together by selecting one or many faces of the original shape and choosing connect mirror or join mirror. This will immediately connect the shapes into a single shape. This enhancement expands the mirror function and allows you to mirror complete shapes across a defined datum plane. It improves productivity and user experience and will enable you to easily mirror complete shapes to improve your usability. It also supports preserved symmetry, which is needed during the reconstruction process for generative design.